Now, the impact from 9-11 has been felt in communities across our country. And Fox 59's Hannah Fullman shows us how our community is honoring those memories. This is just one of the many ways people who call Indianapolis home are paying tribute to the fallen first responders on 9-11, climbing 110 flights of stairs, equivalent to the 110 floors of the World Trade Center. It takes more than 2,000 steps to get to the top of what was once the World Trade Center. Put yourself in their shoes for just a brief moment and, and understand the sacrifice that was made. Uh, obviously, there was, there was a point in time where they knew what was going to happen and, you know, they did their job anyway. That's why places like Crunch Fitness are putting themselves in their shoes, climbing that same number of stairs in their memory. I decided to do the climb because I think it's important that we remember the people that sacrificed and gave their lives on such a devastating day. I think it's a huge thing for the community because that means that people still do remember and they still do want to honor those that, that fell that day and they do want to respect the first responders that protect us every day. The day holds a special place for first responders who know what it's like to respond to a tragedy. Our adrenaline overrides our minds sometimes and at that point we rely on our training. It's kind of a muscle memory thing. We rely, we, we, we go back, we start thinking about our training. We don't worry so much about the fear of what the consequences can be. Michael Pruitt with the Bargersville Fire Department knew people on the ground that day including Andy Fredericks, who lost his life. And I remember being attracted to his knowledge of, of the fire service and tactics. And so he was just one of those guys you would gravitate to listen to. That's why remembrance events like this are so important. I love seeing that stuff because when we say we never forget, it truly um, drives home the fact that we absolutely cannot. And so by conducting those types of events is awesome. Each step taken honors another person who lost their life that day. I hope what they remember is the sacrifice that was made. Uh, realistically, they're going to think, oh my gosh, that was really hard. And, and maybe relate a little bit better uh, to what the, those firefighters and first responders did go through that day. The stair climb challenge continues until 9 o'clock tonight. For now, reporting in Indianapolis, I'm Hannah Fullman.